quantum computers are like super-powered computers that can do a bunch of math problems at the same time. They use tiny particles, called qubits, instead of regular on and off switches. Qubits can be in two states at once, which lets a quantum computer do lots of different calculations at the same time. This makes quantum computers super fast for certain types of problems. One of the things that quantum computers are really good at is solving puzzles that regular computers just can't. For example, there's this thing called factorization, which is like figuring out the secret code to unlock a safe. It's really hard to do with a regular computer, but a quantum computer can do it super fast. This is important because a lot of encryption methods used online rely on factorization. So, having a quantum computer could help keep our online information safe. Another thing that's cool about quantum computers is that they can help scientists figure out how molecules work. This is important because it can help us make new medicines and understand how the world around us works. But it's really hard to do with a regular computer. Quantum computers can make it much easier and faster. Quantum computers are still in the early stages of development, though. One of the biggest challenges in building a quantum computer is maintaining the delicate state of the qubits. Even the slightest interference from the environment can mess up the qubits. This makes it really hard to build a quantum computer that works reliably. Scientists are working on developing new materials and devices that can protect the qubits from errors. Another challenge is scaling up quantum computers to the point where they can perform useful computations. Currently, the largest quantum computers have around 100 qubits, which is still far from the millions of qubits that would be needed for many applications. Researchers are exploring many different approaches to scaling up quantum computers, including using new types of qubits and developing new algorithms that can run on smaller quantum computers. Despite these challenges, the potential of quantum computers is vast. In addition to their applications in factorization and drug discovery, quantum computers could also revolutionize fields like finance, logistics, and machine learning. For example, quantum computers could be used to optimize complex logistical problems like routing delivery trucks or scheduling airline flights. They could also be used to train more powerful machine learning algorithms, which could lead to advances in fields like natural language processing and computer vision. In conclusion, quantum computers are a new and exciting type of computer that could change the world in many ways. As researchers continue to work on building and scaling up quantum computers, we can expect to see even more amazing applications of this technology in the future. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button to receive more like this in the future.